Hey y'all, this your girl Rita Epperson back in the building. I want to do a reading today, and it's gonna be for my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see what's going on with you today. <coughs> I heard a song early in my head, but now I heard she's a runner, she's a track star. So I might got something to do with it. I don't know. Let's see. Y'all already know I smoke. This is who I am. If you don't like it, you know what to do. But for those that I don't offend, uh, stay tuned. Also, if you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to my video. As well as uh, check out my social media pages for different type of readings. But let's get started. Spirit, what is the overall energy for my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What is the overall retreat? It's time to disconnect from the world. See? <coughs> Didn't I just tell you? I just heard it. She's a runner. She's a track star. <coughs> yeah. Uh, somebody is retreating. So what's going on with my collective for my Libras? I say new opportunities coming your way. Brand new opportunities. You're coming out as the Ace of Swords. The Page of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords. There's some lessons that gave you some type of idea. Or you might be offering uh, a new opportunity. Due to whatever this new truth is or the beginning is that you... Mm. Uh-huh. 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 Alright. So, this is what's going on. You got a lot of page in this. So, it could be some communication coming in. Somebody could be offering you an opportunity with this page of Pentacles energy, which is actually going to bring you some clarity or some truth. It could be about somebody being independent and stable and loving. You could receive a brand new opportunity. From whoever this person is, they give you some type of truth. The Page of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords, somebody's going to come forward. This is like the energy of an olive branch. Somebody actually might want to, it could be you, that might want to uh, offer some type of olive branch with the truth to somebody that they feel like is uh, single and loving or somebody that is very independent and intuitive. I see that somebody expressed why it was a, a, a situation with this message this page of wands energy. I see there was some type of communication with the four of pentacles that somebody is no holding, no longer holding back. With the two of swords and the ace of pentacles. Ah, uh, there's some type of communication or some type of message. Or it could have been some type of idea that I had. That somebody is no longer... Mm, Whoever this person is, is going to come forward with the truth. They're going to come forward with the truth to whoever this person is. This person is who is independent and stable and abundant and loving. There's some type of whatever the communication is. Somebody's going to tell the truth that they're not stable. That they're lacking stability right now. And right now they're about at seven. They're refusing to make any decisions. They're, yeah, they're lacking the stability. The Knight of Cups and the Ace of Wands. Yeah. Somebody want to offer their cups to someone in a passion in the beginning. Do some missing out. Do some missing out. They missed out on the opportunity. Yeah. The Knight of Cups to the Ace of Wands to the Four of Cups to the Knight of Pentacles. This Knight of Cups, whoever this is, want to want it's a brand new passion in the beginning. Due to them being disappointed or missing out, on, I feel the energy of missing out. So this is what's going on, Libras. I really, really feel like this is your energy, to be honest with you. I see that there's a brand new opportunity. It's something that is, is, is like with the Page of Pentacles and the page of wands this is a brand new opportunity for you a brand new sense of adventure so you offer your cup towards somebody i see there is some type of truth or a brand new idea that somebody's holding back or somebody could be holding tightly to a passionate union 
whoever this person is, this person is single and they're refusing to make a decision right now because of past disappointments. But whoever this person is, they're very intuitive. I feel like they're listening to themselves about a brand new opportunity being presented to them by somebody who's very loyal. Whatever this situation is going on, somebody could have retreated, somebody could have went into hermit mode. Yeah, you could have, yeah. I feel like somebody could have spoke to you. Whatever this Ace of Swords is, a four of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, somebody probably want to speak about something that's not stable. There was some type of communication about something not being stable. Or it could be some communication coming in where somebody is no longer holding back and, and, and blocking a brand new opportunity. But somebody's going to speak their truth. Somebody could have backed away. Somebody is in hermit mode right now. That's all I'm hearing. That's all I'm really seeing is hermit mode. All right. I'm going to use my Kepper deck for my Libras. What's going on with my Libras? Hey, oh, yeah. You got house, expectation, and main meal. So whoever this is, whether this, this is a Libra man or a Libra woman, this person is waiting for their house. There is some type of house that they're expecting, whoever this main man is. So this can be a divine masculine. The main male is usually the emperor of the deck. This could be a baby father. But right now, this person, right now, they lack in the stability. The, whatever excitement they do have or whatever this new idea they have, they could express how they lack in the stability. That's why they're refusing any new opportunities. Yeah. Yeah, there's a, a situation where somebody's expecting to move. Be, due to them being in despair or deep regret about a, a relationship, somebody might be going to court. Somebody might be in regrets about a marriage or a higher level commitment. And there's some court case going on. Yeah. And whatever this court case has to do with a type of decision that is being made. And that's, yeah, yeah. Okay. Hold on, give me one second. Yeah, so I see what's going on, Libra. Somebody is really thinking hard about you. About giving you an unexpected offer because they feel like you are... The privileged lady, the, the the important one. Yeah, somebody's in despair about whatever this relationship was. With courthouse, it changed because there was some type of decision where somebody had to move. That's all that is. So now, whoever this person is, they're really thinking about whatever this, this uh, money is that they're expecting. Or they could feel like um, that it would be a come up to be with this privileged woman in high armor. I don't know exactly what's going on. All right, but let's see. Spirit, could you clarify for my collective Libras? What is going on with this situation? Okay, you got letting go, releasing and walking away from some clouded judgment or decision. Uh-huh. Okay, somebody's decided to release and walk away from a situation because it was unbalanced. Somebody decided to disconnect from a situation. It could be somebody disconnected from someone that they were chasing. Yeah. Or somebody could be uh, moving towards chasing someone. Yeah. Yeah, somebody's letting go of whatever problems they had due to things being unbalanced. And it was unbalanced due to some type of secrets. Somebody's starting to disconnect or detach due to whatever choices or, or decisions that they needed to make. And they're about to go ahead and chase somebody that they have a crush on. Somebody's going to chase their secret admirer. Somebody is definitely going to go towards a situation. I feel the energy of whoever you is, Libra, you're just going to heal from whatever this situation. I feel you moving forward towards something else. Um, I'm going to grab my other deck, and it's going to clarify a little bit of what's going on. So, Spirit, what is going on for my collective, my Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? 
Okay. Stable man that got this shit together is crazy. And because they always... Okay, whoever this person is, collect. this is a stable man. They're crazy as hell. They're always indefensible, but this person always tapping into your energy, though. This person is always on your mind. This person could be having this shit together, but they're a little loop-loop. A little bit. A little loop-loop. And then this... Yeah. Tapping into your energy, yeah. Yeah, this person... This person is always... Mm, this person is crazy about you. That's what it is. This person is crazy about you. With the nine of wands energy, the guards up. This person is holding their guard up. But they tapping into their energy. Why them bad themselves? They, they probably be thinking about you a lot, collective. Betrayal. Yeah, whoever this person is, this stable person that's got a lot of issues is because they witnessed a lot of infidelity and betrayal. And they have childhood trauma from that. So they could have been in a situation where they could have witnessed their mother or their father betray someone. Yeah. And whoever this person is, they have tattoos. And this is also a person that goes to, to the extreme for attention. Yeah. Yeah. This person goes to the extreme. I don't know what's going on with this person. Yeah. Somebody wants to be in a happy relationship. But they're burnt out, though. Ah, uh, somebody was in a happy relationship that ended up burning out because they thought the, the grass looked greener, but it was really fake. Yeah. Yeah, see, this is what's going on. The, whatever this happy relationship that this person was in, it lifted their spirits. But somebody was burnt out due to them living above their means. And they were in a relationship with somebody that was very egotistical. You understand? This was a person that was all in their ego. Whoever this is, collective. Mm. It was a lot of chaos and drama because somebody was single and didn't want to commit to the relationship and just wanted to free themselves. Yeah. Somebody just done. Yeah. Can't trust them. Yeah, this person, you can't trust them. They switched up on you and started doing way too much. Whoever this person is, whoever this person is, collective, mm -mm. you switched up on them. You let this go. It was a lot of chaos and drama in this situation, and you decided to let it go with a single woman and liberated yourself from whatever it was holding you back because you knew you couldn't trust this person, and you switched up on them because they was doing too much. You had to. Or it could have been this stable man that was dealing with a woman that switched up on him. I feel like you, whoever this stable man is, is tapping in on the energy of somebody that they want to pursue. I don't know what's going on. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to use my love orca. That, that's going to bring a little more detail to this situation. <coughs> Spirit, what happened with this situation? For my collective Libras. The sun, moon, rising. I see home again. <clears throat> right now, somebody's trying to figure out where they're going to live at. Their home is a mystery. Somebody somebody might be homeless. Somebody might be trying to figure out where they're going to stay at, to be honest with you. Or where they want to go at is a mystery to them or a decision that somebody's trying to make. Yeah, they got some unfinished business due to some type of magnetic attraction they had to somebody uh, who they feel like is financially stable. It might be, uh-huh, yeah, I'm going to tell you right now, whoever this person is, collective, this person is going to come back towards you because they're attracted to you because they think you got money. This person uh, has a third party that they're still dealing with and there is a player, third party and party player. This person, yeah. This is unfinished business with a third party because whatever a magnetic attraction they got to with this person is to celebrate. Yeah. They they come in, this person is a player. The only reason this person wanted to come back because they see you doing good collective or oh, or oh, Libra. Yeah, wedding. You got a wedding going on, a higher level commitment, legal matters, change to Family and roll the dice, yeah. So I see that uh, 
I see change. There's a change going on. Where somebody was in a higher level commitment, but there's some type of legal matters going on that caused a major change. Due to somebody having a family and rolling the dice, somebody could be going towards a higher level commitment or walking away. Yeah, single and social media, yeah. Yeah, somebody is deciding to go ahead and close out a situation and change. Whatever this family dynamic they had, they're going to take a chance for somebody that they feel like is single and somebody that they got their eye on social media. So, um, Libra, I want to get some advice from Spirit about what's going on with this situation. I'm going to use my Kepper deck so I can tell you what's going on, but I really feel like you need to be careful with this person or cross-watcher. If this person comes back to you, is it because they see you doing good? What's going on for my Libras? What, 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 what do you have to say for my Libras, Spirit? What advice do you have for my Libras? Child. This somebody can have children. Eight plus one is nine. That's uh the end of a cycle too. Child and mature man. Then oh, it might be a brand beginning with somebody who's mature. Eighteen plus five is thirty three. Is twenty three. Two plus three equals five. Transformation change. There's some type of brand beginning with a mature man. I had to like the port on this one. All right, Libras. Yeah, somebody's doing some alone time. Somebody's been doing some shadow work. All right. What advice do you have for the collective Libra, Sun, Moon, Rise? Stay optimistic about your love life and, and keep an open mind. Romantic feelings are really worth exploring. Express your love. Yeah. Listen. Spirit is saying stay optimistic about your situation. Keep your, your mind open. To the fact that you know you want to be in a relationship and express how you feel about actually wanting to put time and energy. I feel like this is what you want to do. And Spirit is saying that whatever this situation is with this person that switched up on you, now that you, you know. And also, it might be that this person is coming back because they see you doing good. But just be careful. But collective, um, I see that you need to go ahead and stay awesome and keep your open mind. Yeah, to, to whatever this new beginning is for you. Because this is something good for you. All right, y'all. See y'all later.